you know Balatal, you know uh, it's from uh, resin from a tree at home, the bullet wood tree as they call it. Anyway, we were able to again get a Sri Lankan rubber scientist to work with us for a few years to look at the possible uses of Balatal. And the most interesting thing that we found out of Balatal when we started to work was its chemical relationship to rubber. Uh, in chemistry, there is a relationship that we define as stereoisomers. Now what that means is simply that if we take a, a rubber molecule, let's say my left hand, and I put it in front of the mirror, the reflection, my right hand, is the balata molecule, which tells us that anything you can do with rubber, you can do with balata. And so said, so done. We use, first of all, uh, a way of separating the pure latex after it comes from the tree from the resinous material. And we use that latex to make something called rubberized coil fiber, which was used in the furniture industry. It allows you to make single piece molded uh, uh, cushions, which you can then use along with foam in the furniture industry. Uh, the coil is from the coconut fiber, and in those days we got the coconut fiber from Belbang, which was uh, another government organization for youth, and they had a coconut fiber uh, factory which extracted the fiber from the coconut husk. Uh, so we were able, th this became a, a, a strong revenue center for the center, because people were buying that to make their mattresses, etc. Uh, uh, before I leave Balata, just before I left the, the, the institute, we managed through the, a fund called the OPEC Fund to convince them to finance a pilot plant which we would use to go com well semi-commercial with some of the Balata products that we were able to make, uh, rubber gloves, uh, stamps. You know the stamps, the rubber stamps that in those days we used uh, in the office. Uh, we were able to use it for uh, rubberized paint, which you use in, uh, in painting uh, the signs on the roads, etc. So this plant basically was to field test uh, some of these products. But then I left the center in 91, just after the plant had arrived. And I'm a little disappointed that it was never uh, put into operation. But we, we felt that the Balata had a tremendous potential.